I'm so sorry, guys. I didn't post last week. I know no one gives a crap, because who cares about me? But, uh, I kind of want to start this video off by saying, uh, I'm sorry for not posting. I've decided I'm not going to make these videos every single week. So if you really want to see these videos, it may come, it may not come. I don't know. Depends what I'm doing in that week. Depends if I'm busy or depends if I really want to make one. So, yeah. So, sorry about not posting last week. So, uh, let, let's review some memes, shall we? Ah, uh, yes. Sonic the Hedgehog. Uh, this is, this is, tra the trailer came out for it and, uh, it's pretty bad. But, uh, maybe some cads I've seen this videos before. Um, Sonic the Hedgehog trailer, but, but Sonic is slow. So let's see how long this video is. <laughs> Three. Tet slow. That's. <laughs> That's beautiful. I like the music as well. <laughs> that was good. I, I like that. Um, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog trailer, but with memes, I'm not gonna watch. I'm not gonna watch all the trailer. Sonic trailer. Oh God. I feel like this video is all gonna be about Sonic. No, let's do. Let's make all these memes about Sonic. <laughs> Look at another Sonic meme. Look at that. Look. <laughs> I've heard they're actually gonna change Sonic's look. The director of the movie was like, "Hey, yeah, th this movie got a lot of criticism. We're gonna change the design of Sonic. Probably connect his eyes. Like maybe wear gloves. That's what Sonic is. <laughs> Sonic wear gloves. But that's kind of my gripe. He's not wearing any gloves. Cause you know that's what." You know they, they do this is actually kind of a stupid question but is mario and sonic in the same universe like i know this is a stupid question but are they because i don't i never know because i see them in like like there's like this olympic game or whatever like mario sports and i saw sonic and mario together i'm like do they live in the same universe they wear the same type of gloves that's why i had that connection like do they live in the same universe i don't know i, I don't know so because i'm not a big sonic fan i'm a big mario fan he's not a big sonic fan so but I know enough to know that this is not what Sonic looks like. Definitely not this, but in the regular trailer, he does not look like what he does. <laughs> the people can expand up to 55% when you look at something you love. Pikachu? Oh boy. Uh, <laughs> Sonic. It just shrinks. Oh, that's great. <laughs> I prefer the real Sonic. I said the real Sonic. Perfection. That is, be that is beautiful. Uh, I'm trying to get to you right now. That's beautiful. That is a beautiful Sonic. Like, that is... I, um, no, I'd rather prefer this Sonic, actually, um, now that I look at this Sonic, it's a bit ugly, so, yeah, this one sparks joy, this one does not spark joy, <laughs> god damn, you know, when I originally looked at the trailer and looked at Sonic's design, I was like, no, that looks fine, but then, when I look at it again, and again, I look at the trailer multiple times, I realize that it looks ugly, and I see why people want to change it. Because it looks ugly. It doesn't spark joy anymore. The first time I watched Trill, I was like, oh, I guess it's pretty funny, you know, ha ha. But then I watched it again, I'm like, oh. It's not actually. <laughs> it's, uh, just Jim Carrey doing stuff for about a minute in the trailer and just seeing this Sonic doing stuff, so. <laughs> Jim Carrey has severe back pain. The actor is suffering from having to carry the entire Sonic movie. What was I saying before? about Jim Carrey. He was messing around for about a minute. He was the best part of the damn trailer. Now, if you want to see the trailer for yourself, if you haven't already, don't. These memes and watching other people's trailers, like the one I watched before, Sonic plays really slow, or Sonic with memes, go ahead and watch those, because those are a lot better than the actual trailer itself. So, yeah, but I feel bad for Jim Carrey. I think he's actually returning to acting. And this is his first movie I believe he's back in. This is a Sonic movie. Whatever, he's probably gonna 
steal the show. So, <laughs> if you forget history, we were doomed to repeat it. Holy crap. I knew this guy's face was recognized once because he was in the hot movie in 2011 and now he's in this movie. I wonder if that's why they cast him to play this movie because he he was in Hop. He's used to, he's used to being with a CGI character for the entirety of the movie and now he's used to being with CGI stuff. He's with Sonic and I can't believe they're in a car. Why is this so similar? Did they really want to make a Hop 2? Why don't you just play Sonic with Hop? I would've been fine with a Hop 2. Release it during Easter? That would've been fine. I prefer a Hop 2. But no, we, we have to get Sonic. Really ugly Sonic. God damn, that's pretty cool though. I must admit, that is cool that the same actor is playing in the Sonic movie. He was in Hop. <laughs> He's in Sonic. Jesus Christ, he has no morals. He just wants to be in anything. Oh boy, I can see why they get there the... I can see why where the, the, the CGI developers or director has gotten his inspiration to make this hit the movie Sonic. But he took all the good stuff about um the the, the uh what what is his name? The the the, 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 the ripoff Sonic. And you take actual Sonic, all the negative stuff kinda combined together and that's that's what you put in here. Maybe opt all the bad stuff about him, good stuff about him, combined together and boom, you get Movie Sonic. Uh, Sega. Sonic 2006 is the worst disappointment in the history of the Sonic franchise. Paramount Pictures. Hold my chili dog. <laughs> you know, I don't remember seeing Sonic 2006. Like, I'm not a big Sonic fan. I don't see, I don't really play the games or watch the movies or TV show or whatever, but what I've seen of Sonic is that, uh, I, I don't know. I haven't seen Sonic 2006, and I've heard that it's the worst Sonic movie out there until this one. I mean, Sonic, this, this Sonic, that's coming out this year to be the best thing ever. If, if the leg, if you can make a movie out of Legos, then I'm pretty sure you can make a movie about Sonic. But, like I said, it could not be good. Because the trailer looks like it's a regular movie. And it doesn't look like it's in the Sonic world, which I wanted it to be. I wanted to see Robotnik, or just fight Sonic, do whatever they got to do. It doesn't, why do they have to make an origin story? They always have to make everything the most basic thing possible. Because they want to make it to a franchise, I know, but if you can do it in one movie, why don't you just do it in a movie? Why do you have to make an origin story than a sequel if there isn't a sequel? Because there probably isn't going to be a sequel if the movie's bad then. Because the sequel could have been the original thing, but they're not. Because companies don't understand that you want to see the actual thing itself. You don't want to see the prequel before the thing. So, there's my two cents on it. Paramount Guy 1. Okay, so how do we make Sonic Rings? serve some purpose in the upcoming movie. Paramount Guy 2, uh, I don't know. Paramount Guy 3, Guy, so I watched this, this new movie called Doctor Strange. Um, yeah, that is why you, they, so the rings can travel to different places. I'm pretty sure it never happened in any of the video games. I'm pretty sure it never happened before. I'm, I'm not too sure. But aren't the rings like collectibles? You just their, their currency. This is why fans of Sonic should make movies of executives over at Paramount, because Paramount they don't know their products. Like co co companies don't know their products, and that's why uh that's why the fans know more. But the fans can't make movies because they, they 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 it's just the way it works. You can't fans can't make movies. Because he has spent years and decades. None of that, just years and years and years. You know, being in film school, being a director, having credibility to actually make a movie. And, uh. So, but a couple of these executives say they, 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 they worked years, decades to get to this point to, uh, to make these movies. They're, they're, they're executives for a reason. They, they, they know what they're doing. They, 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 they want a ring to travel somewhere else. They are damned to do it. <laughs> But I'm pretty sure, pretty sure, uh, that never happened in video games. I, I, I don't know. Someone explain me. I don't know. I don't know at all. That's not it. I really enjoy doing this. Um. Oh man, I'm, I'm dying. I'm done. I looked enough at Sonic. I kind of want to get this video over with and edit it so I don't look at Sonic's ugly CGI face again. So if you guys have enjoyed this video, 
hit that like button and subscribe. I'm gonna go now, so bye. Uh, yeah, I confess, father, I confess.